Hey everyone, I'm Teach Pine, and we're back to Reach for the Sun, and today we're growing a lilac. So let's go for the lilac. In an ancient times, in ancient times, the shoots of some lilacs were hollowed out to make pipes and flutes. This fragrant plant, which belongs to the olive family, comes with many stems. Grow them out as far as you can. Challenging overall difficulty. Seed yield, seed yield high and hardiness medium. And it costs 12 seeds. We have 12 seeds. And we go to fertilizer and we go for strategy mode, obviously. Because we're full. we are totally strategizing everything. Because I'm a pro strategizer or something. And um, that's our beautiful lilac. We're, we're a lilac. Isn't it wonderful? And there's a butterfly. Sweet. Hi, butterfly. What's your name? My name's Lilac. So, I use gun upgrades to boost the resources. So, we have fertilizer. So, we can double our nutrient income twice. Um, twice per. Yeah, twice. In two turns. I wonder if we can do it in the same turn. Probably not. So, I think we first we should go for some water for obvious reasons. Because we need water. So, let's go for water. Okay, looks better. Um, do we want to double our fertilizer or uh, nutrient income? No, I don't think so. Let's switch to the next turn. So it's raining, that's good, that means we get more water. And, um, we seem to have a nutrient problem again, so I think we should go more for, for more roots. We could, we can build two roots, no, only one root probably. So probably a root stem that it is. So let's do a root and is that a leaf or a stem? That's a stem. Could build a leaf, but a leaf would not be horrible. Can we build a leaf? That's a stem probably. Yeah, and that probably as well. Okay, it's all stems. So let's now let's actually go to the side. I have, have more hopes in getting a, a leaf there. What did we get? Leaf, there we go. Oh, this thing can grow f far, it seems. Um, fertilizing doesn't make any sense. So we lose actually a lot of resources here. It's quite disappointing, but don't see a way around that. So let's continue this. Okay, we actually need some starch capacity. Huh. It cries for uh, cr cries for a leaf, really. Wow, this gives us tons of capacity, actually. Might be a really good investment. Can we build a leaf and a root? 12 nutrient, 11 water. Yeah, we can. What does a stem give us? Well, no nutrient gain, that's for sure. No, that's uh, not nutrient, starch. So I think we go for a leaf for the starch gain and... St well, actually, we need mostly starch capacity, but this gives more starch capacity as well, so... Yeah, let's do that. Oh, it's a beautiful flower. Okay, and I think we go for a root. Can we go for a root and a stem? Oh, we might. We can. Oh, that's good. That means we can go for a root and a stem. That's, that's, that's quite effective, I guess. Let's build this uh, middle stem and see what we can grow there. Only another stem. Good thing I was going to the side last turn. So, yeah. That was decent use of resources. Um, bunch of nutrients. But uh, the rest is used. So. Okay, it's raining again. Uh, we're a little bit low on water. Ha. Huh. What to do, what to do. I think we need more leaves. The problem now is, uh, we can't build leaves. I should have built that stem. Can we build a stem, stem, root, and leaf all together? Nope, we can't. Okay, to use our water perfectly, we would have to, oh, well, we cannot. That's tough. I would like to build a leaf, but I can't. Well, we could go, well, we could if we don't build a, uh, a root. Can we afford to not build a root this turn? We probably can actually. So let's build a stem and a leaf. Not sure if this is a good idea, but uh, I'll go for it. Let's 
so there we go some even decent starch gain um, and got some good capacities so we're full on resources this term um, So, but now we need roots again because we're running out of nutrient gain, or we don't have enough nutrient gain. So let's let's go for roots again. I think. What can we build here, by the way? Stem or flower, leaf, stem. Okay. Yeah, I think we should build another root. All starch gain is, well. I think about leaves because it gives capacity on starch, which is quite good. It, um, it gives capacity on everything, but we need more nutrient gain. And uh, roots give nutrient capacity as well, so it's not too bad. They're quite expensive though, though. That's, that's quite a problem. But I think we can build some other stuff as well. Oh, we could go for another road. Could probably go for another route and build something else. Yeah, we can. So I think we do that. Let's build another route. And stem or leaf. Um, let's think, think about that. I think leaf. We need more nutrient capacity. There was a leaf somewhere, wasn't it? There. There we go. That was a good use of our resources. And we have pretty decent capacities now, and our gains are quite high as well. So, water might become a problem when it stops raining. We could go for an early flower to to build these, to get the 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 resource we get over have have over. Um, to put them into into pollen, but I don't think it's worth it. Flowers are way too expensive, so I think we go for more resource gaining stuff. We should build more stems. Um, we can build a lot this turn. I think we go for more resources. Uh, roots. Well, actually, let's go for some stems. Stems are pretty important right now because we need uh, we need the nutrient gain, uh, the starch capacity. I mean, and um, yeah, we need the starch capacity to get more starch. And the nutrient gain is is good and fine. Well, actually, nutrient gain is pretty important because nutrient is our lowest. Well, it's not really because our our starch capacity is so low. And stems are pretty cheap and give us uh, three capacity on starch, so it's not too bad. I think we go for that. More stems and a flower. Okay. Let's think about our resource usage. We have 29 starch, which seems to be our, our uh, limiting resource this turn. 21. We cannot build everything, uh, three of everyone. Um, we might build 23 for a stem and root. Oh, that's not very good. We might build three things if we build a leaf and a stem because we got 16, 13 more. Yeah, we should be able to build more then. Um, if we're lucky, I'm not sure what the next leaf costs. If the next leaf is only one starch more expensive, we could go for two leaves and a root. Do we have space for two leaves? Probably not. That's a flower. That's. I don't think we have space for any leaf, actually. So if we're not building another stem, we're not building a leaf this turn. So we go stem root or stem leaf. So let's build a stem first. Yeah, that makes sense, right? That makes sense. Where do we do it? I think here.
Uh, that doesn't. Then that didn't give us a stem, uh, f uh, the leaf option. That's that's bad. Okay, we can go. We can go for a root now, but then we're out of resources. Or we go for another stem and hope we can build a leaf, which might be better. Well, our nutrient gain is not that high, but I think it's a better idea anyway. So let's do that. Uh, where can we build a stem now? That's a flower. Can we build a stem here? Okay, let's try that. That's a leaf. Very good. These news of our resources. And we have a lot of nutrients over, but we don't get them too many, so that was not really waste actually. We go to yeah, we lose three three nutrients. So it's not great, but um not terrible either. And we lose three of the other two as well because well we lose more, but could have used three. This turn, which we didn't. Should use a fertilizer at some point. So that's that's a point why uh, actually a good reason not to build too many roots because we can pump our reaching gain pretty hard in that game. Flower, flower, stem, or flower, another stem, and I think another flower. I have a lot of flowers actually. I think we go for another stem. Well, actually, we need roots now. We need more nutrient. Well, maybe not. Maybe we don't need more rich nutrient gain because with the with the fertilizer we get a lot of nutrients anyway. Let's actually build a stem first. Let's see what we get. Okay, flower, 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 and here we can build stem or flower. The question is, do we want that? Well, the stem will probably give us another flower, so it's probably better to build a stem here. The question is, do we want to do this, sister? And how many resources? We have everything more or less the same. Um, can we? What can we build? We could probably go for uh, 11, 22, 36. We can build everything from water perspective. I think from every 34. And uh, yeah, we can build everything once, which might be a good thing. I I'm not even sure if we can build a leaf actually, but probably if we build here a stem here, we probably can build a leaf. Let's build a stem first to get to see our options. I think we want to build a stem anyway, because water and nutrient capacity, um, starch capacity, and then we see what we get there. Is that a flower? That's a leaf. Oh, actually, we destroyed flower, so we can't get the maximum of flowers now. So it's quite simple now. We go for another leaf. Uh, do we? Yeah, we do. Well, we go for two roots, which might not be the worst idea. We go for one root, um, that's for sure. So let's build a root. Oh, we cannot go for two roots. Okay, that makes things easier. So we could pump our nutrient gain. Um, do we want to? Probably not. We want to build one more root, I think, next turn. How much nutrient do we get? 42 plus 7 is 49. Minus 16 for a root is uh, 49, 39, 33. That's enough for a flower. And 4 plus 5 is 9. To pollen. We probably cannot build much more from the other resources, so no, I think we, we don't use the fertilizer this turn. So. Let's build the last route. And start building some flowers. Oh, I misclicked. Okay, two bees. Um, 
going for fertilizer it makes no sense. We have we will have exactly five fifty six next turn, so doesn't matter at all. This is actually really a hardcore strategy. I'm impressed. But this is okay, it's really easy to get oh wait, there's another Oh yeah, we can build a leaf here, I totally forget. I totally forget we can build a leaf here and we probably sh should we? We don't really need to. I mean we could, but I think it's kind of a waste of resources because the starch and the water is not really doing anything for us and this, the, the nut uh, nutrient capacity is not that great either because of, uh, because of the, we only have 52 um, production. Uh, we can, well, we can sp increase that with a fertilizer. And it is our capping re um, resource, but the point is that uh, it costs 14 nutrient. So we might do that if, if we have have them over at some point, I guess. Okay, let's build another flower first. And then, oh, we could build another flower. Uh, and that's a good use of our resources, so yeah, let's do that. I think we should pretty easily get the four, four flowers. But we have no way of getting the fifth one because I built a stem out of it. So that's a little bit sad. Okay, let's build the last one. And then produce some pollen. Should be pretty easy to get these four, though. Should not be a big problem at all, actually. But I don't think it's worth it to build a leaf. So let's not do that. Um, okay, let's get for uh, get the first fruit. Ta -da! And produce some more pollen. Um, let me click. There we go. And even another one. So it should get really easy, actually. Great! <laughs> totally screwed that. I could go for more fertilizer, but I don't need that. Fertilizer is really not helping with that strategy. You might, you could try to go less roots, obviously, and going for fertilizer if you need to. But if you're getting less roots, you have less capacity as well. So, not, not a great position to be in, actually. So, I don't know if I like that. Come here, B. Come here. Come here. There we go. Uh, uh, let's calculate. Actually, well, we have we have plenty of time with July, so let's just do it without calculating. Even if we're not doing it perfectly. Oh well, it's been all over water, so it was perfectly planned. But even if we waste some resources here, we have plenty of time. So it's turn 13. We have to get four more pollen and two fruit. That that's not a problem at all. So it's raining again. Means we're not running out of water. And in two turns we should be good. Uh, I wasn't sure, I, I thought when I had the option to build a stem or a flower, I, I was pretty sure that the stem would give me another flower. But uh, actually I'm not sure why I was so sure. That, uh, it was not the case, so yeah. Let's build a last leaf, just for the aesthetics, and use the fertilizer just for using it. Can we build use it twice? No, we can't. We probably would have been able to to build another flower. I mean, it's turn sixty now. Um, we would have the resources of one more stem on one more leaf that I used right now. Um, okay, we do not have the capacity of the stem, which we used kind of. But not really, because it doesn't give us uh, nutrient capacity, so 
not that important. So I guess we could have. Wait, why is Steam overlaying this shit? I. Uh, go away. I hope you can't see that, but probably you can. So, okay, let's go. <laughs> um, sorry for that. Um, yeah, yeah, we probably could have built five flowers here. So, we could have, could have gone for perfect, but I missed it. Huh. But it's it's easier than with the flower before. I I, I don't hmm. I don't know if I could do it with the flower before, but I could have done it with this one. So. Um, I felt like this is easier. Four fruits, 28 seeds, awesome. So... Yeah, we'll go for a squash next time. Uh, we can't buy the, the... this upgrade, I think, water pail. No, we don't have enough resources for that. And these two are not doing anything in, in strategy mode, so not getting them. What do they do in classic mode? Reduce the number of harmful bugs that prey on your plants, okay. Cold snaps and blight will cause less harm to your plants, okay. Gives you more regular water supply, makes more additional value to your plant, yeah. Um, okay, that's what they do in classic mode. Not too, too, not too fancy, but quite useful probably. So next time we go for the squash. And um, yeah, we're good for this time. Thanks a lot for watching, have fun, and see you next time.